Hey, what is up Magma Squad? It is Magma Sparks here and um yeah, I just found my uh, phone torch on because my room's kinda dark. But I did promise I'll do a taste test on the butter beer which if you didn't see the vlog it is the last video I uploaded. Um we basically went to um, a couple of Harry Potter shops in York. Um, some people call it Dark Island, I don't know if it is or not, I don't really think it is. It's probably not. Just ignore me anyway, but um, it has kind of like feel to it, like diagonally. I've uh, never been, um, unless I have. I have no idea, I need to research a bit more before I do stuff like this. But basically, it's going to be one long video because I can't be bothered to edit because of my phone battery and also my um, storage is really small on this phone. So I apologize for that. So um, this is actually the butter beer I have got. Um, it is actually called the Fine Cauldron Butterscotch Beer, Butterscotch Cream Soda, non alcoholic. And it's 355 milliliters. They're $2.99 a bottle, or you can get a crate like this or four for $9.99, £9.99 in the UK. Don't know where else it is. Um, but yeah, uh, UK, $9.99 for four, $2.99 for one. So I'm basically going to do a taste test. Um, so I'm going to try it, and then I'll tell you guys what it's like. I think you know what it tastes like, but obviously you won't know what it tastes like, so you have to do it yourself. Um, it does have a ball cap as a lid, but don't be fooled. This is what I thought before. I thought you have to get a can opener and take it off. But if you listen, it's actually a twist cap. So you can reuse these glasses, which are really cool if you're collecting, or you want some Harry Potter memorabilia, or anything like that. It's really, really cool to have. I'm going to keep them, because I think they're cool. As well as in the crate, they look quite cool. I'll probably get more in the future, I don't know when, whenever I can afford it. But basically, this is it. This is the bull beer. Apparently, it tastes exactly like it, so I'm going to... Try it. I've already had one. Uh, I'm sorry, guys. I was a bit, a bit cheeky. I had some um, a couple of days ago. I should have done taste test then, but yeah, I, I couldn't help it, guys. I'm sorry. Uh, but yeah, uh, whichever. I don't know how many people can watch this. So I'm just gonna say I'm not gonna think of the out reaction. I'm being genuine when I say if I like it or not, which you'll find out in a minute. So without further ado, I'm gonna twist it. Cap off, it's actually a natural ball cap. Twist it on and off, as you see here, you can twist it. I'm sorry about my room, by the way, it's a bit of a mess, so this is why you see only my door. Um, but yeah, it smells like um, it's just cream soda basically, but it's like cream soda, but it's got a strong butterscotch taste to it. Um, hence why it says it on the bottle. Um, I, re I recommend having it cold. I've had it in my bedroom, so it's not too cold. It's a bit warm, but either way, it tastes really nice. So, guys, check it out. It's called the Flying Cauldron Butterscotch Beer. It's butterscotch cream soda. I'm pretty sure some people can make it at home if you know how to make butterscotch or you can buy butterscotch and you can mix it with cream soda then go ahead I don't know how to do it but it does say on the side of here that you can add ice cream so you can get like the froth you get at um, Harry Potter Studios so I'm going to enjoy the rest of this I'm going to save the two to like another day but I'm going to enjoy this I've had a long day so I just want to chill have fun play some Call of Duty or something, which I can't live stream at the moment because my internet's completely crap. Um, but yeah, um, definitely, definitely, definitely check this out. And I'll catch you guys in the next vlog or video. Peace.